Hey guys, Just Nikki here. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to download and install the Go to School mod for The Sims 4. There are two things you need. The first is Winwar. Links to this will be in the description box below. The second is the Get to Work expansion pack. If you don't have this for your Sims 4 game, this mod will not work. So. If you want to know how to download this and this beautiful school, stay tuned. Hello everybody, Just Nikki here and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Get to School mod for The Sims 4. Um, now, let me start off by saying that you do have to have the Get to Work expansion pack for the game for this to work. If you don't have it, then this won't work. Sorry. Uh, but this is basically where you get uh, uh, the downloads for it from. So first off, you need this here. There's also a video explaining this here. Um, it is a little outdated, so I thought I would just make another one seeing as this says 2017 and it's 2019. So you need the, the go to school, this is the mod, and then you need this, which is the venue change. What the venue change does, it allows you to go in the game, and you know how when you select what you want that lot to be, so if it's residential, club, bar, whatever, this venue change puts it in whether it can be a high school or an elementary school. So you need both of these things. So you just click on them, download them up, um, and then you would put them into your Sims 4 folder. And I'm going to show you guys how to get there. So basically, all you need to do is find your Sims 4 folder. So that would be in your documents folder. And then you should see something that says electronic arts. You double click that. You should see something that says Sims 4. You double click that. And it should bring you here. You move both the venue change and the get to school mod in this. So yeah, so this doesn't have a folder. So basically what I did was when I went into um, the WinWar file, um, I just basically made a folder that said get to school and I put all of these packages in there. Um, and then the venue change should be in a folder, but if it's not, do the same thing. Um, and that's it. You should uh, have it in your game. Now I'm going to switch to the game and show you guys how everything works. Okay guys, so we are here at the high school. If you guys want to download this high school, I will have a link in the description box below where you can get it from. There are some tweaks that you have to do with it when you download it. There are some doors that are not there or are replaced um, with like a, I don't, I don't know what you call those doors, but some of them are don't have doors. So some of the classrooms um, you won't even know exist unless you put a door there um like here this is a classroom but there's like there's no door so uh just keep that in mind but this is a really nice high school it has um what three floors so this bottom floor this one and this one and then it also has a roof and in the back here it has like a little soccer some tennis and it has like a little gymnasium over here really cute i like it and in the basement there is a swimming pool so this school is really neato i really like it like it a lot um the biggest lot um how big is this lot um does it say yeah 64 by 64 so i'm in Bridlington. i think that's what's called Bridlington bay um where the pets are that's the lot that's the biggest one that i that that's my go-to so um i have it sitting here but let's talk about venue change now so the venue change is this this is the venue change and if you've done everything right you should see something that says elementary old version 
and then elementary school. Don't pick the old version. I don't know why they give you that option. Um, but they're here for both elementary school and high school. So I want this to be a high school. So I'm going to click high school, right? And so the next thing you need to do is you want to make sure that the teachers go to the classrooms and the principal goes to the principal's office and the counselor, vice versa, whatever. So if I, if I go to go to school, you should see this. So this is a go to school icon. The, let me put it on the wall so you can see it better. So this is like a little, I don't know what this is. Let me make it bigger. Oh, it's like a lamb or something. This is for the counselor. And then the other one is for the principal. So I'm just gonna um, put this somewhere hidden, like behind this desk right here. Actually, yeah. Well, I'll just put it there. So, and then I want the counselor to come in here. So I'm gonna just hide it behind this chair. Uh oh. There. All right, so now the principal and a counselor has a place to go. So the next item you need is a podium. This podium will basically be the teacher's podium. So if you put this here, um, a teacher will come in here and uh, they will do what they do. They will freaking teach. Now, if you don't like this, um, what I've done in the past is like shrink it down really, really small and then hide it underneath like a desk or something. And you can put like a cheat called BB dot move objects and it will allow you to put it really close to this desk see right now it doesn't work but if I go to my cheat window which is control shift C and I put in BB dot move objects it'll say it's on I take it off and then oh look at that it works so um that's pretty much all of the basics so I'm just gonna um, fix this school I'm gonna put some doors here and then uh yeah we're gonna see how this works The good thing about this pack, um, well, it's kind of a good and a bad thing because some people don't like you like sharing their stuff like that. But um, the school has a bunch of CC stuff in it, uh, but the person put all of the CC in with the folder. So you don't have to go back and be like, well, which desk did he use? Because I can't find them. Or she um, did she use because I can't find them. You don't have to worry about it. They put all the CC that they use in one folder. Now, usually you can't do that because some people who make, uh, you know, CC don't really like you to share their meshes and stuff. Um, but that person did it. And you know what? That It's none of my business. It's none of my business. <laughs> Good enough all right so i think i put them in all the right places so i have my venue set i have my traits um i put the stickers i put the podiums everything should work just fine um basically now once you've made the high school you know set and everything uh you need to wait for school time right so it's 5 p.m. right now, which sucks because, wait, 
do they only have one door? Oh my god. So yeah, I'm just gonna wait for time to advance and then I will see you guys when it is morning time in the game. Yes, okay. Hey guys, welcome back. Now it's 8 a.m. and it says it's time for Sato to disappear to the world of school. It would make the day so much more exciting if you were to follow her. So do you click join or send alone? You can send them alone or you can join, but we're going to join her. I don't know why I picked Sato because I was on Aaliyah, but whatever. Okay, so we are here. We have arrived to school with the other teenagers. So we have here Morgan, Yato, um, I mean Yato, <laughs> Yuki, um, and Luna and some other, uh, who is this? What? Excuse me. Is this the principal? Okay. So Sato is already bored. <laughs> you literally just arrived to school and you're already bored. You haven't even stepped foot in the door yet and you're bored. So, um, just like if you go to work with your Sims, it gives you little prompts over here to do. So it says, Attend science and technology class. I don't know where that is, but we're about to find out. Um, there's a teacher down here. Attend science and technology class in the gym. In the gym. Why did it exit out? Is there no way to come in here? Now attend class. Hello! <laughs> I swear, guys, this didn't happen before. What do you mean? Attend class, Sato! Do it! <laughs> what do you mean? Okay, there you go, Sato. Okay, so the guy that was upstairs finally went to another classroom, so that's where she's going. And now you guys can kind of get to see how it's actually supposed to be. I swear, the mod did not act like this when I used it last time. It worked really well. Um, this mod is actually really, really cool. Hurry up, Sato. We only got like a quarter of the day left. Let's go. Knees to chest, knees to chest. Who is this? Okay. Oh, okay, you sit in the back of the class. All right. Who, what? I guess that's the teacher's pet. He's just gonna sit at the desk, huh? Am I attending class? Is this thing? Ask a question about programming. Can I ask you a question? Ask a question about programming. Here we go. Oh, I gotta ask four times. Damn, son. Oh, this actually gives me skills. Learning this actually gives me program skills. Ooh. Practice programming. There's no um, computers in this class. There's no computers anywhere, actually. There's no computer room. I just realized this. Maybe this could be the computer room. Um, let's ask about rocket science. I just got a skill in rocket science. Going to school is making me smart as fuck! Okay. So this is basically the mod. You just go to school with your kids and they actually learn skills. I don't think I noticed that the last time I was playing. So who the fuck is that? That's a teenager? This is a teen. This is a teenager. This is a student. This is a student. Girl. Who did your hair this morning? All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video it was really fun to make I hope you guys go and get the mod if you guys want to of course everything that I mention in the video will be in the description box below Winwar, the mod the school everything also I wanted to take a little time out to say thank you guys so much 
for the thousand subscribers. Um, I didn't think I would actually reach that goal, and the it's crazy to think that a thousand people subscribed to me. A thousand people were like, hey, I like this bitch and I'm gonna subscribe. I know I sound like a broken record. I believe I've said this a hundred times before, but I really do appreciate it. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to me and being patient because I ain't posted shit in I don't know how long. Also, I would like to say, I don't know if anybody saw that post, but um, I put out a community post saying that you guys can go and download my Seren in Asia Sims. I don't know if anybody saw it. I know it has like maybe five likes or so, but if you guys want them, I will be putting the link to my Tumblr page. You can download their tray files. There is a list on my Tumblr page of all the CC that I've used for them. So feel free to download all of those. Make sure you get the skins, the hair, you know, I put everything. I put skins, hair, clothes, right down to the piercings. So everything is listed. But anyways, guys, I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.